Hey there everybody, welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Disgaea 5 Complete. Now, I have done a lot of grinding. And when I mean a lot, I mean... Yeah. I got a tomb and kill you up in almost 50. I got almost everybody else at least in the 30s. And then some people are straggling along in the 20s. I got, obviously I got Logan, but I'm not using Logan for anything other than throwing. Isalia is 20 still. I got Arinder Z, uh, Healer and Geese. Like these are monster classes that are not gonna go anywhere. I made this guy the Minotaur for whatever reason. I don't know why I decided to make that, but he's here now, so he's a thing. And most of these quests I actually did already. Like the quests that I had here, now I'm down to like some of the last of the recruitable characters. Like I got the Dark Knight and the Sage. Uh, I think I need to get the Angels. And I think that's about it. Like, there's like maybe a few recruitable classes left. I've unlocked literally everybody else. So yeah, it, it, it's uh, I've been hard at work here. Now there's a lot of monster classes that I don't have unlocked, but those guys I'll worry about as I get through the story. Like go, hey, please select where you want to go, dude. But yeah, so I did a lot of item world grinding. I made a lot of hell. And I just did a lot of stuff. I don't even remember what was going on story-wise right now. I just remember somebody was getting chased, I think. I don't remember. Uh, it's cold. Are the lost really here? The information about the lost being in Isaac Hell came from your Prinny. Huh. If their information is wrong, then those Prinnies will be frosted by the chilling breath of an ice maiden. What's wrong, little Usa? Are you cold too? About the coldness. Watch! Just blow it super away with your muscles! Are you scared? Are you all not scared, Clip? When your enemy is void dark, that means 10 billion lost soldiers are out to get your life. Among them is the demon general who cast that spell on me. That is exactly what Red Magnus Super desires. To beat up that pile of monkey crap, boy Dark, and become the strongest overlord! The strongest overlord? If I can avoid combat, I'd prefer not to fight. But when they attack, I will fight back, and without mercy. I do not enjoy barbaric fights, but I will resist anyone who tries to take away my freedoms till the very end. All of the men you see here are my servants. Tasked with fulfilling those duties for me. <laughs> you are all so strong. I don't have that kind of strength. That's why my mother and father were killed by the demon general. And my home world was destroyed. But I still live on in shame. I would have been my father's successor. As the overlord of Toto Bunny. I should get revenge and take back my home world. But I want to be strong like you guys. And get revenge for my parents, Flip! If a child like her wants to get revenge for her parents, she must have received a lot of love from them. Love? No, no, such a thing doesn't exist for demons. This girl is probably planning something. Revenge for your parents. Revenge. Revenge is too heavy of a burden for a child to carry on their shoulders. You probably shouldn't try. I know, Clip. But if I can't do that, then my life will have no purpose. It's the Lost. Everyone, get in formation. We've finally found you, Usalia of Toto Bunny. Huh. You want little Usa, huh? How immature. All you adults ganging up on one little child. You guys are the rebel army, aren't you? We've been authorized to kill you on sight. Obey or die. You guys no longer have any right to choose. Die. All right, Netherworld effect snow is active. So if I'm remembering correctly, that means these guys take extra water damage. 
Alright, so they're in their twenties. Oh man, I am super over leveled for this. Hmm. If that's the case, I can actually ignore using these guys. I could probably bring out some of my lower people and actually get them some EXP now. Hmm. I don't really care for Logan or anybody below Logan, so. Time for some mages. Alright, you should be able to one shot you from back there, actually. Or close enough to it, anyway. I'll use Christo here. Out of range, really? Bash won't do much here. You guys, let's super go. All right, let's run with this. Just get some free damage. Let them come to me. Yeah, magic change, magic change, don't care, don't care. Yeah, you guys are gonna do negligible damage now. Now, the only one I'm actually kind of worried about is Euphora, because she has no real defenses. But for that, I have clerics. So, you're dead. You can take an impaler drop. As for you, you can just take a revenge mode swing. I'll stick Kefla in the middle. See who gets combo attacks. There we go. Look, look at that combo damage. That's some disgusting damage. Mm hmm. Magic Knight's still pretty hefty. Alright, so we're gonna do this. Put that. I could burn out their magic change turns by doing this. Yeah, now die for me. Thank you. Now here's the thing that sucks about the the knight that I have out right now, the Onyx Knight. She does very little damage, but she also takes nothing. She's actually great for defending and running out the front line actually. Oh, that's cute. Ice. Like, you see, 150 damage. That's, that's it. I think that was all you did, kid. I can't throw you up there, though. Hmm. Actually, maybe I can. If I move you up here. Actually, no. Let me throw Red Magnus up there. What am I doing? Red Magnus has... Uh... Let's go call it right now. He has revenge. Let me throw him forward, actually. How long does he have revenge for? One more turn? Crap. Okay, here's what I'm meant to do. I'm gonna have to move Red Magnus back to where you started. Alright, I got an idea. This way Red Magnus can get some distance. And maybe get an attack off of the giant. Super Olympia. Alright, there we go. So, Mega Overlord Red Magnus appears on the scene. Body slams that guy out of existence. Let's see, we're gonna move you forward. Just destroy that. Cute. Ignoring all these 
because I just don't want to waste time. Uh, let's see. Question is, who has a good throw? You do, apparently. Can't throw that high. All right, if that's the case. I'm gonna get you down there. You know what? This is actually very low and useful. So here's the cool thing with Logan's ability. If he doesn't move, he can actually just infinitely throw. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take you, no. Take you, Logan, and throw you that way for later. still alive. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna have those people who Logan hasn't thrown yet walk to him. So no. Keep throwing her up there. We're throwing her up there. Look at this, look at this, look at this. Infinite throw chain. really handy in situations like this. So I'm gonna have you kill Abraham, you attack Rocky, and if Rocky doesn't die, you got that. Boom, boom. Blade Rush and Flame Flash. Yes. Alright, so that takes care of you. I'm gonna have you walk up and heal uh, Logan over there. So here's where the Magic Knight's going to be really useful. So with the Magic Knight, she kind of acts like a mage and like a, um, oh my gosh, uh, she learns, or not, basically she learns, um, the same sword mastery moves. So let's say, she's, she's basically like a combination of a warrior and a mage put together. Like that's the easiest way to put it. Hence the Magic Knight. But she learns all the same sword moves that a regular warrior would learn or anyone using the sword mastery would learn. And then she applies an element on it. So that's kind of her shtick. And the cool thing about it, in my opinion anyway, is that it gives you access to elemental moves a lot sooner than you'd actually normally get. At least for a um, melee class character. Like, she's pretty much the only character that can do it, which is amazing. Let me grab her and throw her down there, actually. Because now that I know you have a water weakness, I don't have any water moves yet. But I do already come with the spell Ice. So it's going to hurt you quite a bit. Now, what's amazing is all her spells are actually tied in just by Weapon Mastery. So, if you want to have her learn the moves real fast, go to the cheat shop, change the weapon mastery stuff to like 100 or 200 percent, and she'll pretty much learn the moves ridiculously fast. See? Now we just learned all the mega skills. Magic Knight has been mastered. Oh, did I get the Dark Knight already? Oh, man. Okay, so the Dark Knight class as a whole is ridiculously powerful. They're pretty much your endgame warrior characters. If you guys are with me, I'll only cause more trouble for you, Flip. One who murdered my parents, destroyed my whole world, and is still coming after me is Demon General Majorita Flip. She is very persistent, Flip. I bet she won't stop coming after me until she kills me. Demon General Majorita is that girl. Do you guys know her, Flip? Yeah, 
We've encountered her before. It's a miracle that you guys have faced her and still live, Blitz. That's impressive. Come to think of it, she said something about a girl with a yellow pretty. She must have been talking about you, Usalia. Does that mean our lives were spared because of Usalia? Maybe she'll be able to help us. I don't mind having you as one of my servants. Y yeah. Ha! <laughs> don't be stupid! You're saying that little brat spared our lives? If we fought back, the Supreme One would have super won, of course! <laughs> you really can say anything with that cocky mouth of yours. You are the strongest all-talk overlord. Uh, you bitch! So that's what happened, Blitz. We've all been brought together in unique ways. Well, this is a form of fate. As long as you don't cause any trouble for me, you don't need to be so modest. It's no trouble, little Usa. You're the best bait to lure out that demon general. Right, everyone? Usaya is bait. I see. Blitz, understood. Then I think I can help you guys. Usaya will be your bait, Blitz. Let's put the bait idea aside for now. We don't stand a chance against the Demon General, even if we do lure her to us. Lives are at stake in this war. It's pointless if we can't win. What do you all plan to do about this? That's not a problem. We just need to fight, fight, and fight our way through, till we take Void Dark's head. What I need to do has never changed. That doesn't solve anything. If we could win battles by just recklessly plowing ahead, Red Magnus would already be in charge. <laughs> you know the Supreme One all too well, little Sisto. That wasn't a compliment. It would be easier if only I had more power. Now, hurry up and unleash me. You actually do know, right? That I can kill Void Dark in an instant? Speaking of power, I've been wondering why you all have so much potential but can't exert your true powers. How did Red Magnus know? Before he knew it, he had gotten weak. You became weak? Is it even possible for an Overlord to weaken? <laughs> that sounds like an excuse. Weren't you just really weak to begin with? Yeah, right! Red Magnus used to have enough power to split a world in half with his fist! Oh, wait. Split a world in half? That's crazy, Blitz! Hmm. Well, that's quite interesting. Something must be the cause of your loss of power, right? Right. Uh, the, the Supreme One hasn't lost anything! What is it, Kilia? Men have a secret or two that they don't want anyone to know. Those were your words. Yeah. Then there's no need for us to investigate each other. We were all brought together by coincidence to accomplish the same objective. Respect, Kilia, respect. Alright, let's go to the cold blooded dew. Toto Bunny. Huh? Looks like you've attracted some maggots. You! You killed my mother and father! I will! I'll never forgive you, Flip! <laughs> well, that's surprising. A kid who used to piss her pants and cry a lot is now trying to challenge me to a fight? Interesting. Do you really hate me that much? Do you even need to ask? Revenge for my mother and father! I'll take it now! <laughs> I can't wait to see that rage-filled face of yours become tainted with a look of devastation. W what do you plan to do? I'm gonna do this. The 
Skrullis. Yes, the Corpse Master Overlord, summoning this many corpses at once. There's nowhere to escape. Uh, I'm not going to lose to these guys, Flip! Little girl, did you mention something about revenge? Then overcome these corpses. If you could get to me without losing any body parts, then I shall reward you by taking you on. <laughs> All right, let's see what is going on with this one. There's no effect here. Got a geo panel of recovery 20. Not that helpful. That it? Just recovery 20? Maybe for that, I'll just go out there and fight them myself. Let's do this. I'm gonna bust out the big boys. Let's go. Cause I want to make this go by as quickly as possible. Let's go. Uh, you're not in range yet. I will. All right, so now you're in range. We unfortunately don't do enough. So we're gonna use yeah. also our lovely magic knight, who has flame slash. Which should do quite a bit of damage here. Ha! Gonna back you up with Setsuna. And yeah. Giselle. Let's see if Giselle can hit you with a rabbit arrow from here. Nope, can't. Okay. Put Giselle back here. Yeah. Serafina behind you. There we go. Solid, solid. More enemies came out of the enemy base panel. Oh man! Oh. Okay, so there's enemy base panel. That gel laser is gonna be a problem. All right, you're dead. Flame slash. over there we go let's see what we could do here phantom blow and have you walk up is that rain leave it to me that cloud. You guys, let's set go. Madness. Steel and light. No, won't reach. Impale a drop will. So might as well. Let's try and do these guys. Wow. That is a cool move. Doppelganger. Let me hey! Not gonna back it up with Vash. Right here, and Vash can use Victory Bullet. There we go. Now use Akbar. Who's going to use? Isn't really needed here. 
More enemies have come out of the base form. Okay. Interesting. We have bought these guys all out of here. Let's look at another one. Mm. Here's I'm gonna rapid arrow. Rapid arrow again. Let's see. I have a use thing here. Bullet on this guy will be best. So that way he can stand here and phantom blow these guys. Alright, so I can share that. I should kill these guys. Oh, I almost kill them. Shotgun crap on fire, I just realized that, so. Mind shard, and there we go. Awesome. Alright. More enemies have come out of the base panel. What a shock. This is like the easiest HP. I wonder if it stays like this. Cause if, it's, if this stage just perpetually gives out more enemies, like forever, you could make this into a really good farming spot. <laughs> so what I'm thinking is, oh, we need you over here. Put you back in the base. This is where Logan becomes useful. Not exactly something like this. Throw Logan over here. We're gonna kill Anubis here. Hmm. Alright, now. More enemies out of the base panel. What a shock. Hmm. out of the base panel? And that's it. Takes care of all the enemies. Ooh, so close. The Duke surrendered.
Sirens are so helpless and pathetic. That is why we need a powerful ruler, like Lord Void Dark. Lord Void Dark is the only one fit to unite and rule the disorganized netherworlds. So I need to kill more demons. And just kill, 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 kill. All right, I guess you need to kill some people, Margarita. You are actually a little crazy there. All right, let's heal everybody up real quick. Welcome. Let's see if we got any new items while I was uh, power farming. The cestuses, the machete, the floral spear. Eh, nothing new here. All right, moving right along. Where would you like to go, dude? Alright, back to the Winter General. Lusalia. Hey, Lusalia. Huh? Oh, I'm sorry. I was thinking about measures I can take to combat global warming, Flynn. Lusalia, if you're gonna follow us, then I need you to promise us one thing. What is it, Blip? If you encounter Majorita again, don't act on your own. I don't want to be interrupted. Understand? Yes. I'll be careful, Blip. Hey, Kilia. Don't you think you're being a little strict on the kid? You fool. Sir Kilia is being strict with her because he's worried she might overreach and end up losing her life. Do you not understand that undemonic kindness? You, stop putting words in my mouth. My, excuse me. But for a little girl like Usalia to bear that much hatred, something big must have happened to her. I don't know. She lost Even her family, now, her whole planet. I remember what happened, Blip. My father built Toto Bunny all by himself for demons who don't like to fight. Even though it was a netherworld, it was a peaceful place. But then Demon General Majorita showed up and everything changed in an instant. My mother and father resisted till the very end. But I wasn't able to run away in time, so Majorita cast a spell on me. And then you had to obey. Yes, Majorita's spell would turn me into a beast and ultimately kill me. So I had to weigh my life against the fate of my world. Majorita approached my concerned father and told him that if he obeyed her for a hundred days, she'd remove the spell. My father believed her and obeyed Margarita. But that was part of Margarita's trap, and it was only the beginning. did non-stop hard labor some were told to become suicide bombers in other netherworlds and some were just killed for sport but everyone in my home world obeyed for the sake of Toto Bunny's only successor me but but my mother and father were killed before the hundredth day even came child who had gotten bored of its toys she killed them and took them apart a true overlord should fight fair and square in a clash of power against power what a coward that little brat red magnus will never forgive her obviously i can't forgive margarita but i can't forgive myself either what do you mean if I wasn't dragging them down, my parents wouldn't have been killed. Or if I was brave enough to end my life, everyone died because of me. They must all hate me. So when I'm done getting revenge... I thought there was something more behind her motivation. But she's purely driven by vengeance. The love her parents had for her was strong. So 
though her determination to get vengeance is equally strong. Love, huh? I didn't know demons were capable of such a thing. I... That got real dark. Zombies? Again? More of that little brat's henchman, huh? Is she testing us? Or just messing with us? Probably just messing with us. My pride will not allow me to be toyed with by some child. Sir Kilia, get rid of them now. Uh-uh. You're gonna have to fight too. I was like, excuse me, who do you think you are? Alright, snow is in effect. How? Man, this is this is one of those stages where you have to use the blocks. I got a feeling it's one of those stages. Yep. Gotta make stairs. Let's go. Uh, I hate these kind of things. No, I did not mean to pick up you. So we're gonna have to make stairs. Great. So let's just grab these and. Throw them to places that they need to be. Right there. Stairway ha. to heaven. Ha. Bada boom. This blue one. I cannot throw that high. Uh, where are you, Logan? You have become suddenly useful. This is your time to shine, buddy. You won't have to move an inch. Throw stuff. All right. So now, leave it to me. Take Cloud and walk this way. So he should be able to walk up the stairs. Now everybody should be able to walk up the stairs. Oh, Logan's taking a beating. Logan's gonna die on that. Goodbye, Logan. Oh, he's still alive. Leave it to me. Oh man, Logan, you took a serious beating. So we're just gonna return you. We have Euphora. Oh no, not Euphora. Uh, I see you far out. I'm at Akbar. You come out and heal Cloud. Great. All right, you're gonna attack here. You're gonna attack Zach. You're gonna attack Guido. You're gonna attack Guido. Should be good now. Wow, he lived. Alright, there we go. Swing back. Alright, this is Kakashi. Who has... Uh, let's see, we're gonna attack you. Because you have a lot of evades, so you should be okay. Wow, that actually still hit. Oh man. So you're dead. Let's go. Great. Let's go. We're gonna use Phantom Blow. Oof. So close. You're dead. Back up now. This is why you overload characters with shoes, because then you can jump really high. 
Let's see, you have 100% crit, your jump is 24, your jump is 42. That explains so much. I can't throw you that high yet. What if I th use you to throw them that high? Can you? No. Okay, so what I need to do is actually throw Logan. Alright, so... She's there. Because I guess because of the lift. Alright, you're still dead though. Like, everybody up in this corner is gonna die. Alright, 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 come on. Too many animations. Just the rabbit. Double Usa swipe into death, and yeah, that was easy. Okay. No demo skippage. The lady Usa Leah. Wasn't that? C could it have been Toto Bunnies? That is certainly possible. Majorita is the Corpse Master Overlord. She can restock her forces by using the bodies of civilians she murders from the various netherworlds as her servants. Plus, corpses don't require food or water. It truly is kill and recycle. That's far more economical than using prinnies. And they seem far more useful. I'm jealous and outraged. Usalia, if you're gonna back down, now would be the time. If you keep on going, you're definitely gonna witness something that you don't want to see. You know what I'm trying to say, right? I will defeat Foy Dark. In order to do that, I'll face the demon general who cast that spell on you. You'll get your revenge, even if you don't get it yourself. There's no need for a child like you to do this. It's okay, Kilia. I'm ready to do this. I will handle our battle against Majorita. Oh, I'm so respecting you, Usa. Alright, now. Let me... Let's fix you up. Heal up again. Let's check out this event. <clears throat> Madam Serafina, did you call, dude? You do this all the time, but are you gonna make us do something crazy, dude? <laughs> Whatever are you talking about? When I was your kind-hearted ma- When is your kind-hearted master ever make you do anything crazy? You've got a lot of nerve to say that after making us work to the bone, dude. Um, I've called you here today for one simple reason. The corpses we encountered don't drink or eat and can fight for 24 hours a day. I'm fascinated by their work ethic. A cold sweat is dripping down my spine. I have a bad feeling about this dude. 
So, from now on, I'll be treating you Brinnies the same as those corpses. H hold on a second. No eating or drinking for 24 hours. We'll die of dehydration, dude. What about our salary? What'll happen with our one month of sardine? Don't tell me we're not gonna get them. What are you talking about? Corpses don't need salaries, right? Come on, dude. Do you have any idea how much we do for you? That's so cruel, dude. My, it was just a joke. Madam Serafina? Now, look up and wipe your tears away. I am not the devil. Even though I act like this, I do recognize your contributions. Madam Serafina! That's I'll provide you all with one sardine every... One tiny sardine every three months. Will that be enough to encourage you to work hard? <laughs> Madam Serafina! Thank you very much. We'll, we'll do our best, dude. This has gone beyond a sweatshop. We've just witnessed the rise of a sweat conglomerate. <laughs> oh no. A sweat conglomerate. Welcome to America. Oh no, man. Where would you like to go, dude? Alright, back to Isakel. Class A frozen soil. to make it all the way here. You're good. This voice! Margarita! I'm not here to play games with children. Where are you? Show yourself. <laughs> but isn't it an adult's duty to play games with children? The things you have done in the past go way beyond child's play. Her magical powers are also way beyond those of a child's. In fact, I don't believe our opponent is a child. Just leave it to Red Magnus! The Supreme One will give this super little brat a spanking she'll never forget! <laughs> you, Muscle Gorilla. I know you. By Muscle Gorilla? Do you mean Red Magnus? That wasn't a compliment. Oh yeah, now I remember. You're the overlord of Scorching Flame. Or at least you were before I destroyed it. What, what did you say? You! You? Destroyed Scorching Flame? I was going around being destructive and crazy, but you never showed up. I thought you ran away, but it seems you were hiding here. It was you! So you're the one who did that to my netherworld! I heard that Scorching Flame was full of strong demons, but it was pathetic. <laughs> no more spanking! You're gonna be super murdered! Yeah! Damn it! Fight fair and square! <laughs> okay, I'll make you a promise. If you can defeat these corpses, then I'll face you. Look, woman, we already did that. Alright! You better hold up your end of the deal! Man, more corpses. All I want to do is take that stupid, smug little child and wring her neck. Because sweet Jesus is her personality annoying. Alright, attack plus 50, defense plus 50. This is just... Oh, lordy, lordy, lordy. This is amazing. These are fun panels for me, less fun for them to be on. So I just need to put my best people on this. Because I need this to go by as smoothly Let's as go. possible. Put Chilia, a tomb. Uh where are you? Where are you? Where are you? I wanna put Setsuna out there on the defensive side. Because now her defenses go even higher. 
I'll put Julius or Julius Red Reesefield right there. Put Cristo back here. Uh, Red Magnus can go down there too. Uh, Serafina, go back here. Alright, go here. Cloud. Can guard pretty much up standing there. If you can stand there. I'll let them come to me. I'm not walking that way. up it's gonna be met by a different character I don't know what I'm gonna do a set over here though let's see you're only level 23 so actually red magnets might be able to just two-piece you super Olympia steel arm lariat uh, just attack the old fashioned way. Mm, should be able to use the excavator here. This one, I'm gonna use this. this is slime. I'm going to use flame slash. Death Strike puts me over there. I'm not gonna put you down there. Mm Hurricane Below counts as wind. Is Hurricane Below you death? Yes. Alright, there we go. Alright, now for the final, what well, should be the final turn anyway. How'd I do that? Uh, what is Purgatory Palm? Uh, let's 
Come back. Let's see what happens. Purgatory Palm. Blade Rush. Interesting move. Thank you. All right. Can I stop with that defense, please. Thank you. All right, you need to die for me, buddy. Takes care of that stage. Stingy deity. Nice! Margarita! We won! Hurry up and come out here! It's pointless. Margarita doesn't keep her promises, Split. I told you, she does whatever her opponent hates the most. That's just Margarita, Split. Fred Magnus's brain is made of gelidium jelly. Didn't you hear what Usalia said? What? Are you telling Red Magnus that he was super fooled? The one who killed my parents was right in front of me. Who was just playing with us. This is so frustrating, Blip! You're right. But we don't have enough strength to face her. Not yet. My, how foolish of me. I almost forgot to ask a very important question. Hey you, muscle idiot. Is it true that Scorching Flame was destroyed? Yeah, it's true. Scorching Flame was turned into a wasteland. How did that happen? I don't know. I was taking a nap, but by the time I woke up, everything was wrecked. I couldn't even find a single one of my underlings. They were most likely all killed by Margarita. And that's when I noticed I was missing my powers. Damn it! And that's the real reason you're fighting the lost. You want revenge, too. Red Magnus's netherworld was also destroyed. That means we're both in the same situation. No, no. In Red Magnus's case, he was taking a nap while his netherworld was being destroyed. It's an entirely different situation. Yes, it's his own fault. He was out shouting, I'm gonna be the strongest overlord! But what was most important to him was taken away. He doesn't have any right to call himself an overlord. Uh, shit! You just watch! Once Red Magnus can unleash his real powers, that little brat will be finished in one hit! Alright! In that case, Red Magnus will super beat up that little brat and Void Dark, and then we'll all be even! Then, finally! Red Magnus will create a super scorching flame and become the strongest overlord! My, what was I thinking? For a second there, I was actually jealous of your flower garden like brain. Alright, so now we're in the hopefully the last area of Let's that fix you chapter, up. or that's uh, Netherworld here. Uh, do I have to talk to them? Yeah, might as well. Damn it! Ah, okay, that was a bit... <laughs> that was a bit loud, sorry about that. Damn it! That little brat Margarita, Red Magnus is gonna find her and then totally lay the crackdown on her! Super Olympia! C calm down! If you go berserk here, Seraphina's gonna shoot you! <laughs> Sarah doesn't scare the Supreme One! If she just wants a piece of the me, just bring it. 
If you stay calm, I'll give you a larger portion at dinner. Kill you? Oh, oh all right. If you're going to go to those lengths, then Reg Magnus will control himself. You'd sell yourself out for a larger portion of dinner? What a cheap overlord. Cheap, fast, super delicious. That's the Scorching Storm Overlord, Red Magnus. Oh, no, you don't. Wipe that confident look off your face. I didn't compliment you. All right, just deactivate your overload. There's no need to waste your energy outside of combat. Hey, Killer, you make it sound like Red Magnus' overload is useless except for in a fight. Huh? It's not? Don't be ridiculous. Becoming giant is super useful. Like when? Well, check this out. See? Red Magnus can reach high places like these. It's super useful for cleaning. Oh. Do you even clean? <laughs> of course not. So then it is useless. Oh, man. Red Magnus, you're too funny. Don't stop being an idiot. Alright, back to Isaac Hell. Wow. Interesting. You guys have faced those corpses and still managed to stay alive. I was looking forward to killing and recycling you guys to add to my collection. But... You're the one who is going to die! To avenge my mother and father! On guard! <laughs> to avenge your parents? Then... What will you do about this? Don't you do it. You jerk. I knew it. This is the ultimate form of kill and recycle. The tearful reunion. <laughs> Great, now I gotta go kill her parents. Controlling the corpses of Usalia's parents and making them fight her. That is too cruel. Damn it! Hey, little brat! Do you have any blood, sweat, and tears? <laughs> This is all for my crusade to create a demon utopia. I will go to any lengths to be victorious. A demon utopia? Yes. The unification of all netherworlds by Lord Void Dark is the only way to rid the netherworlds of war. Huh? To create peace in the netherworlds, you're going to destroy them? That doesn't sound very rational to me. Be quiet. If all the netherworlds are unified, then there won't be any point for a war ever again. I, along with Lord Void Dark, will definitely create a netherworld utopia. You dare talk about a utopia after doing this to my mother and father? Stop fooling around! Stop your yapping. They were one small step toward netherworld unification. You should be grateful. Little girl. I'll kill and recycle you too. That way, you can be with your parents forever and ever. <laughs> All right, let's finish this off. Oh, her parents are the boss. So I don't even have to fight Majorita right now. Which leads me to assume there's still one more episode, or one more, like, map after this chapter. That's gonna be for Margarita. Alright, I'm gonna just have these guys line up like this. And then as they come down, I'll just be killing all the zombies. Let's have fun!
Here we go. Don't underestimate me. Ha! I will. Just all these spells. Being pains in the neck. Here as well. Rapid arrow combination here. Shotgun craft. can't poison you there, so I'm just gonna hit you. Takes care of the first floor of zombies. Stay back. But Julia, we can't do anything. My, they became corpses. Wouldn't it be kind to put them to sleep? We're fighting a war. There will be times when we'll have to make heartless decisions. Now, Kilia, you make the decision. That's not something I can choose. <sighs> <laughs> <laughs> Uh, interesting. They're saying that we can choose what happens here. Because if that's the case, I'm not really sure what I would do. Like, can we save her parents somehow? I mean, we have the capture squad so we can catch them, I guess. I'm not sure how that would work. Let me see. Like, now I kind of want to think about that. Like, that's tough. There's no real, there's no real, uh, like thinking about it, there's no real sort of precedent, I guess in a sense, for trying to salvage those two guys. Oh, he said something, I didn't hear it. Alright, I'm gonna figure out what it says. Kill this one. I'm gonna see what she says. Right, I 
know you can use items twice in a turn, so... I should have a healing one in here somewhere. Here we go. Saying Salia. Oh, this is so heartbreaking. I don't like it. <laughs> Alright, Demon General Madrida, you are getting such a beating. Hey, wait a second. Who said you get to destroy my treasure chest, you asshole? Come here. Come here. Let me, 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 let me teach you a lesson real quick. Lesson in something called pain. And suffering. Mm. Die, 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 die. Die, die, die. Everyone's in revenge. Everyone's gonna die. That's how it goes. Oh, that was actually really sad. Finish them off. Uh, I want to get revenge for my parents, but to do that, I'll have to destroy them. I, I can't do it. You should ease their pain. <laughs> I feel bad for them. Their daughter is so horrible. Well, you are still a little fun. As a reward, I'll kill you myself. Kill and recycle. Die. And have fun spending some quality time with your family. <laughs> Step up, Margarita, so I can kick you in the face. <sighs> You're finally bringing it. Red Magnus was getting super tired of waiting. Julia, stay out of this. She's gonna pay for destroying my netherworld and henchmen. She's about to go one on one with the Supreme One! A piece of garbage like you is gonna go one on one with Demon General Majorita? <laughs> How dare you look down on me? Such power! Her power alone has that much impact. Meanwhile, Kilia just eating. This is bad. I recommend we make an emergency retreat. Run away. This is no time to be eating. Y'all are late to this party. To away. We have to force our way out through combat. Hello, everyone. I'm sorry. It's my fault that you're all in this situation. Uh, damn it! Why can't Red Magnus unleash his powers at a time like this? Don't worry. And recycle. <laughs> so you can die first. What do you want, Bloodis? Do you plan on interfering? I have orders from Lord Void Dark. What? Lord Void Dark? Destroy Explocution immediately. Why? Do you need a reason to follow Lord Void Dark's orders? Explocution, huh? All right. I'll destroy it by tomorrow. But hold on a second, you! Uh, of Father. course. Father! Now, 
How should I deal with you guys? This is the Lost's number two. He is rumored to be Void Dark's right hand man, Demon General Bloodis. <laughs> Such intimidation! Red Magnus is super excited that monstrous contenders are coming out one after another! Your voice is shaking. and unleash me you actually do know right that i can kill void dark in an instant obey or die which one do you choose later historians have determined that the strong animosity against demon emperor void dark was proportional to the amount of territory he had captured. But there weren't any big uprisings, because the demon generals that worked for the demon emperor had everything under control. It was said that each demon general alone were able to take down two to three thousand netherworlds apiece. It's the Nether Soccer League Championships! Our Demon Black faces the Death Row inmates from Hell, the Dark Eleven. Soccer overloads and deadly formations are constantly unleashed. Due to lack of rules and rough play, Demon Black is in danger. Damn it. At this rate, we're gonna lose. Our youth. Will our dream of conquering all the Netherworlds be crushed here? As everyone starts to give up, their savior appears. It's super intelligent, beautiful girl striker, Seraphina! The number one beauty in all the three worlds, the number one richest in all the three worlds, and number one in number of servants. That has nothing to do with soccer! Next time on Kickoff to Hell, Episode 6, Miracle Summoning Miraculous Fine Play. If you give up, the game's already over. Burn the image of my soccer overload, direct money bomber, into your eyes! Isn't that bribery? <laughs> direct money bomber. All right, that was amazing. Managed to clear the whole chapter in one episode. I mean, I'll take it. But all right, guys, it has been fun. It's been another great episode of Let's Play Disgaea 5 Complete. I hope to see you all here next time. If you liked today's episode, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And if you didn't like it, go ahead and drop the thumbs down real quick. Just drop a comment letting me know what you think I could do better or just, you know, what you think I should be naming some of these other characters because uh, if you go on our Facebook page or our my Facebook page there'll be a link in the description below um, you can actually go ahead and see what monster classes or which human classes I'll be recruiting and then you can drop a name off in the comment section if I like the name I'll add a character with that name now just because I already have a lot of those human classes already doesn't mean I won't be recruiting a second or even a third one of the same class. I usually do that just to, you know, pad out the the lineup there, have a little bit of everybody, and then just in case I need multiples of some people, I'll have backups. So, with that in mind, uh, if you liked today's content or, you know, my content in general, go ahead and hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, that way you're always up to date on all of the newest stuff. Uh, that I upload I'll always upload somewhere between 2 to 4 p.m. that's the general plan it depends on how long it takes for the episode to render and process on YouTube's for uh, you know system it <laughs> some of these episodes take a while so I try to get them up a little bit earlier than normal just to make sure that it's up on time but at least that way you know if anything happens you guys already know what's in the like you know what's going on and all that but Hope you all have a great day, and I will see you here next time on Let's Play the Sky 5 Complete when we go ahead and take on, you know, Chapter 6. So, hope to see you all there. Have a good day, everybody.